Hello, Blue Island residents. It's been a few weeks since my last message, and as it relates to our city's coronavirus response, that's a very good thing. We've seen a decline in Blue Island's COVID-19 positivity rating over the past several weeks, and we're on target to move to phase four of the Restore Illinois plan soon. Should everything continue heading in the right direction, you'll be hearing less from me as we move from the emergency phase of our response to the recovery phase, where city administration and the building and health departments are taking the lead to ensure Blue Island reopens safely. As of June 18th, the total number of Blue Island residents who have tested positive for COVID-19 stands at 502, with a total of 3,253 tested. Since my last update, we've had no additional employees from the city test positive for COVID-19. The total number of employee positive cases since March remains at six. Last week, Chief Arzab and I met with representatives from the state regarding the status of operations at the former Metro South Hospital facility. Currently, the building is at a state of readiness for use as a COVID-19 treatment facility and will remain so as the Illinois Department of Public Health assesses the pandemic and potential for a second coronavirus outbreak later this year. Should the state decide to activate the facility, Chief Arzab and I will be notified several weeks in advance and will provide you with an update at that time. In his video message last week, Mayor Vargas directed city department heads to prioritize activities that help reopen Blue Island's economy and the community in the safest manner possible. Health and building inspections have resumed in full capacity. As a reminder, if you are a bar or restaurant owner utilizing space for your outdoor seating, you must email the seating layout and capacity plan to building department official Ahmed Sandino at asandino at cityofblueisland.org. More information about phase three operational guidelines for businesses can be found at blueisland.org. At City Hall, the building department and clerk's office have resumed their regular hours. The second floor of City Hall is accessible by appointment only. The Blue Island Public Library is now offering services by appointment, as well as curbside pickup. You can learn more about their services and programming for the summer at blueisland.org. The John D. Rita Recreation Center, including outdoor playground and athletic fields, remain closed during phase three of the Restore Illinois plan. As a reminder, we should continue the habits we've adapted over the last several weeks to help keep ourselves, our loved ones, and our friends and neighbors safe. Keep a safe social distance of six feet or more inside public places, and wear a face covering if you cannot keep a safe distance. Please avoid touching your face and wash your hands often. For the latest coronavirus updates and information, please visit blueisland.org slash coronavirus. This page contains resources for residents, seniors, and businesses, and is updated daily with news we receive from agencies around the region and state. Thank you for your continued support and adherence to the Restore Illinois Plan guidelines. Be safe, Blue Island, and be well.